map from the port of Harwich to the port of Lowestoft and a new film called Life of Lowestoft. It's been put together by a 17-year-old called Joshua Fremantle who did the research, the editing and most of the filming. Mike Liggins is in Lowestoft now. Hi, Mike. Hi Stuart, yeah it's a bit chilly here now but we've had a fantastic day. You know Lowestoft has had plenty of critics over the years but people who live here tell me that this place is really on the up these days and that's very much reflected in this new documentary. The East Coast Cinema in Lowestoft and alongside the blockbusters a new documentary, Life of Lowestoft. This a world premiere at a social distance. This is the UK's most easterly town. A big day then for the young man who made the film. Joshua Fremantle is just 17. It was his idea and although he had some help, it was Joshua who made it happen. Yeah, it, it really shocks people. Well, you know, that it's been me that I've created it. I, I always get still, you know, oh, how old are you? I'm only 17, you know, at the moment. And, and that really shocks some people. The documentary, just over an hour long, is ambitious. It looks at the town's amazing history, the fishing industry and the scores, the ancient pathways the through the town. The to the but it also looks at the present and the future. It cost £7,000 to make and was funded in part by Lowestoft Rising, which is working to regenerate the town. There's something for everyone in there because there's things people will learn. I'll learn stuff I didn't know about the town. Um, but it also tells the good news of the things that are happening now. Um, and that's important. We've got lots of good things going on and the film captures that, which I'm pleased with. Hello, good afternoon and welcome to this special event celebrating Life of Lowestoft. A document. Like all good premieres, there was a question and answer session this afternoon with the principals. It was hosted by BBC Radio 4 Zeb Soans, who was born and brought up in the town. His family is still here. I mean, work is in London and has had to have been in London for the past 20 years, but I come up every couple of months. Uh, if I could read the shipping forecast from a beach hut on Pakefield Beach, which is my favourite beach in the country, uh, then I would. And, you know, technology's catching up. That may be possible at some point. Having the red carpet outside this afternoon, you know, making a, a real special occasion for it and um, is fantastic. You know, it's, it's a proud moment. Life of Lowestoft is a remarkable achievement. One young man's dream to tell the world about the town he loves, a dream which has now come true. How can you see the film? Well, it's going to be shown in selected cinemas in Suffolk. It's going to be shown in schools and eventually it will make its way onto DVD. Back to you. Mike, thank you very much.